all familiar with the concept of noise, but did you know that all materials produce it? In an ideal world, signals can travel from one point to another without impairment, effectively transmitting data. But the addition of noise can disrupt wireless systems by degrading communication signals even to the point of signal loss. To ensure systems can handle actual interference challenges, engineers can utilize devices that generate known amounts of noise and deliberately send those noise signals through their system to better understand its impacts and effects. Noise sources are packaged in many different forms, including individual components, calibrated noise sources, coaxial noise sources, amplified modules, millimeter wave sources, and benchtop instruments. However, at the heart of every one of these devices are components called diodes. These diodes produce additive white Gaussian noise, which is a basic and generally accepted noise model that imitates various random processes observed in nature. An AWGN channel adds randomly generated white noise into a system over a normal distribution. Noise diodes produce a fixed output power level. However, when combined with amplifiers, precision attenuators, and filters, they become controllable devices for generating AWGN with specific power levels and frequencies. For over 30 years, Noisecom has been designing noise generation devices and instruments that are used in a variety of ways, including RF signal impairment, jittering crosstalk generation, system robustness testing, signal jamming, and much more. To learn more about Noisecom solutions, visit www.noisecom.com. And if you would like to download the Anatomy of a Noise Source poster, please visit ps.noisecom.com/ans. Make sure to subscribe to our channel and thank you so much for watching.